Okay, uh, welcome back. This is Minyak. Today we'll be continuing the uh, TOS series of uh, okay of the Star Trek Online. Okay, I still I have uh, skills up upgrade. So space point uh, hold restoration. Hold on, go with call capacity and. Okay, and another twenty five percent fifteen. Okay, this is let's go with mm, targeting expertise. The ground specialization, let's go with. Weapon critical. Okay. Uh, photon grenade. Okay. Skill, willpower, device expertise. Okay. This willpower. <laughs> Also trade. <clears throat> okay, this is not good. Use operative. Hmm. Okay, get performance, get readiness, space trade, beam training. No, not this. Go with operative and mm, not accurate. Fleet uh, coordinator. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Let's start with the bed. The, the Battle of Caleb 4 All hands, this is Admiral Garrett aboard the USS Yorktown. I'm the commanding officer of this task force. Our long-range sensor platforms have detected a Klingon battle fleet massing near this system. At the moment, they're attacking our subspace relay network in order to disrupt communications and long-range surveillance in this sector. We have the Klingons outnumbered at this time. Should they abandon reason and follow a standard attack doctrine, fire to disable their ships if possible. A strong show of force should send them back to their side of the line. All ships go to yellow alert. Garrett out. Erika standing by. Orders acknowledged.
art on the sensor, Captain. Okay, something art. What? Torpedoes on my mark. Execute battle plan Sigma 4. Repeat, execute battle plan. Concentrate fire on the business. We need to protect the business. Take prisoner, Core. We Klingons can be gracious in victory. Though, should you wish to die in battle with honor, I will gladly oblige you. I'm picking up a temporal anomaly on the Klingon ships. It's consistent with readings we've seen of previous Nakul incursions. They're trying to interfere with the timeline again. Until we break out of this tractor beam, there is not much I can do, Daniels. Leave that to me. I'll modify the transporter and beam you over, past their shields. Once on board, free the ship and neutralize the anomaly if you can. Hurry, we're literally running out of time. Understood. Beam us to the uh, Klingon <clears throat> to the Klingon ship. Daniels, beam us into a barrack, Lieutenant Commander. I'm not picking any uh, security alerts. Look like we got a drop on the Klingons. I brought uh, several photon charges along. If placed tactically, we can use them to disrupt the ship uh, power grid and take down the tractor beam. Good thinking. Let's move out. I want that tractor beam out of action. Damn, the door is locked and we don't have their door codes. I think I can bypass it, but it will take time. We'll cut it open. No time for anything else. I don't care about the property damage on the, to the Klingon ship.
goes through right here. You need to finish them now. All of them. You don't understand how dangerous they are. I don't need to do anything. Do not forget who is captain here and who is merely a visitor. I've given you the means to victory. I suggest you use them now. Noted, though it seems we have other concerns now. I warned you, Kor. Deal with this. Don't fail me. Well, well. I was hoping for Kirk, but I got you. Pity. So you're the Federation globflies who found their way onto my ship. A bold maneuver, to be sure. Bold or not, you remain insects. A minor nuisance to be exterminated, swiftly and without mercy. Your allies are using you. The Nakul aren't here to help you, they are just here to help themselves. And in that way, we are alike, for we both are here to help ourselves. Today, I will take what I want in the Empire's name and use it to utterly defeat the Federation. And the Nakul? Should the time for war come, we will meet them in glorious battle. But for now, our goals align. A valiant effort, little fly. But it is over! <laughs> Glorious! Charges work, the tractor beam is down and the, uh, the Eureka is free from to navigate, but feedback from the tractor beam took down our warp capability. The other are still caught in tractor beam, though their ship system are operational. If we free them from the tractor beam, we could uh, likely escape. Helm, get us moving. Let's do what we can to help the fleet. under best possible power. Well done. Thanks for the help. Nice one. I don't want it. Thank for heading 265 Mark 10. Best. Run while you can, Starfleet. You won't get far.
at least one Starfleet officer has the courage to die well. Tommy Moon, for me. dead. Your ship was destroyed in combat while protecting the retreat of Admiral Garrett's forces. Your sacrifice allowed Garrett to warn Starfleet about Target Klingon cloaking tech, failed. but your ship was lost with all hands. At least, that's what's in the history books. I've brought you and the crew members I could save to the early 25th century. You're being recruited as a temporal agent. Since you're dead, we're giving you a new identity. We have a speed training and reacclimation process that will help you to fit in. I know this is a bit unusual, but you'll get used to it. Believe me when I say it's better than the alternative. Welcome to Earth Space Dock. <laughs> Busy day on the holodeck, sir? I love dressing up for those historical holo novels, too. My Harry Mudd costume took first prize last year. That being said, you're scheduled for a meeting with the top brass, so you, you might want to update your uniform beforehand. The Admiral can be a stickler for that sort of detail, after all. Congratulations, Lieutenant Commander. Okay, um, that's it for... Where is that, Caleb? Let me check. The shuttle to Saturn will leave in far away 30 hours. Yep. Yep, that's it for Battle of Caleb 4, and now we are going You're to... You're scheduled for a meeting with the top brass, so you might want to update your uniform beforehand. The Admiral can be a stickler for that sort of detail, after all. Okay. 
So we will go to the Klingon War. Uh, well, the Klingon War series. Uh, welcome to starting from welcome to Earth Space Docks on uh, the next video. Okay, this is the end of uh, this video. Um, if you like this video, uh, hit the like button and um, don't forget to subscribe. It's free. Um, this is Minyak uh, signing off until we go to the next video on the Klingon War. Alright, thank you for watching. Goodbye.